Right, greetings and salutations guys. Um, we're about to bring you some exclusive footage, uh, first look footage of Onrush, uh, the new game from Codemasters, also by the former developers of Motorstorm and Drive Club. Uh, as you can see just behind me here, I am currently outside Leeds City Bus Station and it is closed. And that is because it is 20 past 2 in the morning. Uh, so this video, we're going to show you the footage, we're going to show you a bit of gameplay, hopefully get some interviews and stuff in there. Um, but also, we just want to document and show you what the length we go to to bring you this footage. Um, so it's getting at half past two in the morning, well, 20 past two in the morning, my coach leaves at half two. Uh, I leave Leeds, um, it's mega bus, luxury all the way. Uh, uh, we're getting to London about eight o'clock. Uh, I'll be then back, leaving London at midnight to get back into Leeds at quarter to five in the morning. Uh, so it's a very long day. Uh, very, very long day indeed. Uh, but there's going to be so much fun and uh, excitement. We're going to bring so much cool footage. Uh, hopefully, going to see all the stuff you want to see. So, uh, yeah, let's jump to the next bit. Five hours later. Well, guys, it's uh, eight o'clock in the morning. We just got to London, as you can see. Uh, we are in the wonderful Victoria, and uh, yeah, need to find out where I'm going now. Yeah, pretty sure I'm going. And this is the end of the video because I've got lost or um it's next bit coming up, but yeah, we're on our way and see you soon. Alright guys, uh the quick snippet. Um if you can see this big pause from this hair about London. Absolutely packed, rushing a tube. And I'm super quick. Kind of nice and I think it's and uh, I think it's fantastic. Uh, Alright guys, uh, after an hour and a half uh, getting lost on the tube, um, I'm finally in the right direction and I've bumped into these couple of rapper you might recognise from SBOC. We've got Ralph Lidge and Jono here, who uh, we've joined their streams quite a bit. I sometimes do. I'm, yeah. I'm, not good. I'm not good at it. No, it's good fun man, we enjoy, we enjoy having you on the streams always, Badger. You know, give a, Band, yeah, Northern Sand. Northern Sand. That Northern Intelligence. Yeah, yeah. A bit, well, a bit of gravitas. We'll, 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 go, we'll go with that. Okay, yeah. sorry, you're Hadrian's Wall. <laughs> hey, hey, we protect you from the barbarians. Uh, yeah. Right. <laughs> we are the north of Game of Thrones. Yeah, and the White Wall. The barbarians and the White Wall. Yeah. Alright, fair play. <laughs> we'll catch up with you later on, guys. Take care. Hold on guys, uh, here we are at a secret location. We're really, oh, that looks metal. I'm really blue there. Oh, yeah, uh, as you can see, we're down here. Onrush. This is the Onrush launch event. So you see, this is the data live event, so we're going to get hands on with it in a couple of minutes. Um, I'll just give you a little pan around so you can see what these kind of events look like. Um, you know, it's really, really cool going on now, but it's very club esque, is this one. So uh, let's have a quick look around and show you. You see, we have a uh, rush there. Nice wide banks of uh, consoles to play on, Xboxes and Playstations. That's the stage there, where we're, we're about to get a speech from shortly to take us through the game and show us a little bit about it, tell us its development and stuff. Um, so yeah, that's, that's a little done. So I'm very excited for the speech. We're going to go get hands on with the game. So uh, it's now about 12 o'clock in the room. Uh, I've been on the go since 7 a.m. yesterday. Um, but so hopefully I'm going to be. Ah, oh, hold on, right, this is this is this cool bit about the job. You know, it's long, it's tiring, but the job that keeps you going. Uh, so the speech is about to start. So I'm going to sit down and uh, I'll catch up with you soon. Good morning, everyone. Uh, thanks for coming along today. Uh, this is a really big day for us. Uh, it's the first event we've held since joining Codemasters, and it's the first time we're going to be demoing the game live. So I'm really, really excited to show you today and tell you a lot more about Onrush. So let's, let's dive into it. <clears throat> so what, what, before we do that, so let's start some introductions. So obviously we've got a brief introduction from Matt then, but yeah. I'm Paul Roshinsky, the game director of Onrush. We've got Jamie, the assistant game director, who's going to be playing the game live for you today. And we've got Alex Perkins hiding in the background, who's the art director. Uh, and we'll be telling you a lot more about the game today. So, we've all worked together uh, for over a decade on a wide variety of racing games, along with the rest of our exceptionally talented team up in the northwest of England. Uh, and I think it's fair to say that over the years we've built up a reputation for compelling moment to moment gameplay and high quality visuals. Uh, and we're proud of our heritage. And we always strive to raise the bar even higher with every game that we make. 
We're also proud to belong to the Coal Masters family now. We're forging a new era with Coal Masters as the world's number one racing studio, aiming to bring our passion for racing, high speed thrills, and high quality games into the lives of players across the world. And with Onrush, we're pouring all of our experience and passion into what we believe is a powerful new breed of racing, which combines what we know and love in classic arcade racing games with original new ideas uh, to create a new formula that takes influences from other genres outside of racing. From racing with captured the raw adrenaline and the high amp <clears throat> and high impact thrills of the best of the best arcade classics, including Burnout, Motorstorm, Outrun, SSX, and many more. And then from outside of racing, we looked at genres that make non-stop fun for everybody the top priority, bringing elements of their DNA into our game. We captured the immediacy and fast action that we, we all love in fighting games, the multiplayer shooter principle of spawning you right back in the action, and the accessible to get deep team-based competition from the likes of Overwatch, Rocket League, and, uh, and sports games that they do so well. We combined all these influences into Ombrush to create something completely fresh and new, an evolution of the arcade racer. And to bring this powerful idea to life, we've developed a brand new multi-platform engine, the next generation of the Coldmasters Ego engine, which empowers us to deliver more action on screen, as well as rapid load times and high bar from visual quality. For those who like technical details, I'm sure there's some here, it's a DX12 engine with a fully bindless, pure SRT-based renderer. In simple terms, it's cutting edge tech, and it means we're pushing Xbox One and the PS4 hard, and we're taking full advantage of the PS4 Pro and Xbox One X to deliver both 60 frames per second and 4K options for players to choose how they experience the game. So, as I'm sure you can imagine, it's been an incredibly busy and exciting two years for us, uh, joining a new company, creating a new IP, and building a new engine from the ground up to create something we feel as a pent up design for on this generation. playing for insane, breathtaking, over-the-top moments like that all the time. It's a huge breath of fresh air uh, compared to all the other races out there right now. And it works because it's designed from the ground up to celebrate speed, action, takedowns and team play. Onrush is a new breed of racing with a new set of rules powered by the Stampede system. The Stampede system gets you into the action immediately making the powerful and high impact team racing in Onrush easy to enjoy. The system launches you into the middle of the action at 100 miles an hour whenever you start the game, when you respawn after a crash, or if you fall too far behind the pack. And it means there's no waiting around. There's no getting up to speed. None of the slow and serious bits of racing. Just cut to the chase and enjoy the non-stop, high octane action over and over again. And it unlocks a new mentality and loads of new ways to play <clears throat> that reward you for chasing risks, racing with star, and clashing with the pack. And we're bringing takedowns back in a big way. They happen a lot because the Stampede system keeps launching both teams back into the fight over and over again. And when you're on the receiving end of a takedown, it isn't game over. You'll be back in the phone within seconds, right on the trail of the player who just knocked you out, so you can shut them down and get revenge. There's also a bunch of fodder grunts added to the mix, doubling the size of the stampede so there are always 24 vehicles in the action. So you always have targets to chase to keep up your combo. 
the most spectacular moments and the takedowns and numbers are all fueled by boost. The faster you are, the bigger the impact you can make. So you want to do everything you can to keep a lot of boosting your tank by chasing risks, getting bigger, uh, pulling off tricks, getting close to your teammates, and taking the fight to your rival team. And because you can never do too much of a good thing, there's a powerful second level to your boost, and we call it Rush. It's a 10 second injection of explosive speed and unstoppable power that always packs the possibility that you've got the biggest and best moment in the game. And there are eight unique flavors of Rush built into a lineup of eight powerful classes, each with their own unique loadout of extra abilities that take the action to another level, adding variety, flexibility, and depth to the gameplay. First we have the Blade, an all-out assault motorbike that allows you to burst into a rush state that lays down the deadly burning trail that will wipe out everyone who runs into it. The Outlaw lets you slam the ground to create a devastating shockwave and steals boost from the opposition whilst rushing. The Vortex gives you an advantage for timing your boost when landing jumps, and during rush leaves a wake of disruptive turbulent air behind. The Charger gives you the ability to attack other players in the air with a well-timed use of boost, and can literally plan the opposition out of the way whilst rushing. The Interceptor has a supercharged initial hit of boost. By chaining together takedowns, you can extend your rush to be deadlier for longer. The Dying Bomb supplies the team with boost drops, and allows you to power up nearby teammates with a limited boost whilst rushing. The Titan can shield nearby teammates, and whilst rushing, you'll leave a trail of obstacles behind to block your opponent's path. And finally, the Enforcer, which can block opponents from using boost and blind the opposition that stray behind you whilst rushing. This is a new breed of racing, so it needs a new set of rules. In our rush, there are four original team-based racing modes which are all powered by the Stampede. They all deliver hard hitting fun, fast action for everybody, with lots of layers of depth and tactical team play opportunities as you discover new and better ways to score with your team. Every mode has fast flowing rounds, which creates an incredible clutch moment and keeps everyone in the fight until the very last second. Overdrive celebrates a free form style of play and classic arcade point scoring, where you're constantly seeking out your next hit of boost to keep your combo up whilst trying to stay alive and take down the opposition. The skill and strategy comes from working out how to keep your combo alive and when to use your rush for maximum score and impact. Countdown is a race against the clock, capturing the classic arcade thrill of a mad dash to the next checkpoint. You have to fight to squeeze through a series of gates to add time to your clock for your team to keep it from running out. As the clock, <clears throat> as the clock ticks down, the tension builds you see some incredible clutch moments. This is where a rush comes into play, as a strategically timed blast could cut off the gate and snatch the win at the last moment. Switch is an eliminator mode, giving everyone three lines to fight for, and forcing you to change your vehicle whenever you wreck. It's a bit like a gun game in Call of Duty, where everyone's starting on the same level as one of the uh, mod bikes, and eventually progressing to be the biggest vehicles, creating an evolving attack and defense dynamic with all the vehicles, with the final seconds becoming an intense cat and mouse chase as you try to close out the match. And finally, Lockdown, which is a 100 miles an hour version of King of the Hill, that has teams chasing the moving zone before fighting to capture it to score points. And the mechanic of chase and capture creates a unique ebb and floating mode, with the pace slowing ever so slightly when in the zone to focus on the combat, which is where you approach the onrush at its most chaotic. And then everything gets back up to full speed as everyone chases the next zone. All of this action takes place in our off-road heaven, featuring 12 stunning hyper-rail tracks that can be driven at day or night, in rain or shine, even in thick fog or deep snow, and all of which will change dynamically as you play. Every track is entirely unique, with its own standout moments and distinct visual look, all supporting a unique brand of high-impact racing, keeping plays together, and providing layers of risks, rewards, and opportunities. Onrush has a full single player campaign on Superstar so that can be played as you'd expect, uh, solo, uh, as well as with friends and seamless six player co op. The Superstar campaign challenges you to compete in over 90 matches where you must complete numerous challenges and objectives in order to progress to find out about the origins of Onrush and how it became a global phenomenon. On your journey, you'll master every vehicle class, track, mold, all swap, raving seasons, and weather conditions that we throw you for a fun and rewarding campaign. When you play online, 
team play really comes into play, and rivalries are taken to another level. The Stampede system redefines the multiplayer experience, serving up gameplay that you can enjoy with friends of all skill levels, and letting you join straight into events, even if they've already started, which means no more waiting around in lobby. There's a casual quick play mode for fast fun with friends, as well as a structured ranked seasons for higher levels of competition. And we've designed Omrush to offer fresh experiences with free content and updates to keep our community growing around the game. And we'll be continually balancing the game rules and metagame, directly involved in our community and shaping the game with their feedback as part of our live service. Three to the citations, guys. Now we're here down in London at the Omrush uh, exclusive event. Five o'clock in the morning, and we're back in Leeds. There you go. Um, tired. It's been 48 hours uh, on the go. Got a bit of kip on the coach, but um, get on rush. I've seen it. Um, hopefully, it was perfect for you all. Uh, tired, knackered. Out of bed. Got stuff to do for stuff in the morning. Articles to be written. Stuff to be done. It's all part and parcel of the job. Um, this was just a little taste of what what we do. What goes on behind the scenes to bring you these stories. Uh, but yeah, I hope you enjoyed it. Um, I'm very tired right now, but do it all again. Do it all again if remember could bring you the next exclusive, the next exclusive footage. Um, so yeah, just roll some B footage and I'm off to sleep. Bye, take care.